Caitlin met Trevor, they fell in love, and we are here today to celebrate that love. She found her person. We are proud of her, we are proud of him, and we are proud of them. two people so perfect for one another. It has rung true from the first day, and I believe it will ring true for the rest of your lives. Trevor, the day that we met, we talked about this day, our wedding. From the moment I met you, I knew you were the one for me. Later that day, I even called my roommate to tell her how I'd met my future husband. Trevor has a lot of qualities that I admire. Most importantly, he's dedicated to whatever he sets his mind on. His friendships, his decision to become a pilot, or his studies, which if you ask him are very much harder than mine. Caitlin, over the last three years you have gone from a complete stranger to my very best friend and soon to be wife. I'm not ready. Well, show me your tie. My favorite picture of us ever. These years have been the best years of my life. We've made so many great memories and friends along the way. But we also overcame so many obstacles together as a team. Just don't look. Yeah. I'm not thinking. Don't look. Hi, honey. Hi, baby. How you feeling? Nervous, or how are you feeling? Nervous. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. I don't think Trevor feels subtle feelings. Um, he very much wears his heart on his sleeve, and despite what you might initially think in person, it's one of the best blessings you can have in a friend. Kate has become my sister the past few years, and knowing her has been one of the most enriching and fulfilling supportive experiences of my life. Caitlin, as your husband, I promise to support you and our family in everything we do. I promise to never stay mad at you. I promise to never make you drive anywhere. <laughs> I promise to always make you hobbit holes in the morning. I promise to cherish you for the rest of our lives. We will grow together, learn together, and change the world together. Through the years, we have faced obstacles, some harder than others, that have helped us build the strong foundation of our relationship. It has shown me your unwavering love and constant support and strength. I promise to encourage you to follow your dreams. I promise to continue to challenge you to be the best version of yourself. I promise to make you laugh when you're taking life too seriously. Today and forever, I give you my heart, my soul, and my trust, no matter what our future might bring because you're mine and I'm yours. And above all else, I promise to love and cherish you with all my heart. You will always be my person. With the blessing of everyone who is present here today and with the authority vested in me by the state of Ohio, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Trevor, you may kiss your bride. <laughs>
quite remember hearing about Kate and Trevor's beginnings, but I remember the first time I got to spend time with just them. Um, I was living in the city. I took the train up. I escaped the city to hang out with them. And when he asked what I thought of Kate, I had not a doubt that she was so special. They communicate the same. They have the same love language, the same interests. They are two peas in a pod, truly. And they're both willing to sacrifice anything to make the other happy. Part of an African proverb that it takes a village. I look amongst you and I see the village that raised them and made them who they are today. It's about a mother and her son. She's always taking care of him and cradling him until she gets too old. He ends up cradling her. The verse that is ongoing throughout, we used to sing it. I'll love you forever now and always I'll love you. As long as I'm living, my baby will be. (laughs) 